Hey, on site, it's Will here, trying to show you a quick tutorial on how to use the uh, PBWorks website that I just set up. Try going to mypbworks.com. You need to sign up and make an account, but it's pretty easy. Just put your email in and uh, create a password, and then you can enter it. Uh, this is what comes up when I enter. And there's a couple other sites that are using the PBWorks platform, including the Math uh, Wiki. Click on PBWorks 2000 onsite 2012, and that should take you to the site. Uh, there we go. So this is the main page, and to access the lesson plans or to add your own files, you can go to a couple places. You can click on pages and files, you can click on lesson plans by subject just to demonstrate how to add your own files I'll go here pages and files and I will add a file so this uh, button right here upload files lets you upload a file onto the site and I'm gonna go into my documents and I have one here let's try this one grade four to six prison dodgeball so press OK you can select multiple files when you do that as well if you want and there it is it pops up right here at the top and basically if you want to organize this you can drag and drop it into the appropriate folder down here and it will go in there and then Anybody also comes to the site can click on health and physical education and download that file. Um, if you want to just look at files straight from the home page, you can click on the navigator here and click on lesson plans by subject and it will bring up that folder tree as well. Um, I'm going to delete these. These were kind of failed attempts at making folders. but all the folders will eventually have files on them I hope and one thing I was thinking that we should try to do um, let's go back to this page is try to name the files when we put them on in a sort of a conventional way so everyone uh, will find it easier to browse through them so I thought if we started each one by saying grade 6 or whatever grade that the you think the uh, lesson is appropriate for and then saying the subject and maybe the name of the strand yeah, or just putting the name of the uh, activity on there so that way when we go through it it'll be sort of alphabetized by grade level and we'll know what uh, subject it is to so I haven't done that with all these ones I have to change them but for uh, organizational purposes I think we should try and uh, I'll do it the same way, so I'll, I'll post that on the main page. Anyways, that's the basics of it. Sign up, log in, download uh, lessons if you want to, or add your own things. I'm thinking of adding like a list for uh, links to websites too, but I haven't gotten around to that yet. Give it a try.